Assalamu alaikum. How are you doing? I hope you all are doing well. I am very happy to meet you after a long time. Welcome to today's lesson. Today's lesson will be presented by me, Ashma Miss and Ruma Miss. In today's lesson, we are going to recite to a listen a story. Learn, count and eat. Wash hands. And you will be having a quiz. We come to a story from the scene. We will recite. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Qala Rabbi Shrahli Sodari. Wayasirli Amri. Wahlul Uqdatam Millisani. يفقه قولي رب زدني علما وارزقني فهما وجعلني من الصالحين آمين Now it's story time. Do you like story? Children, today I'm going to tell the story about the hungry caterpillar. Let's read the story. On the light of the moon, a little egg lay on a leaf. On sunny morning, the light came to the egg. On Sunday, the egg popped and the little caterpillar came out from the egg. The little caterpillar was very hungry. He looked around. He saw an apple. On Monday, he ate through one apple. How many apples did he eat on Monday? Yes, one apple, right? But the little caterpillar was still hungry. On Tuesday, he ate through two pears. Still the little caterpillar was very hungry. On Wednesday, he ate through three plums. Children, now tell me how many fruits did he eat on Monday and Tuesday? Yes, on Monday he ate one apple, right? On Tuesday he ate two pears. Now count and tell me how many fruits did he eat on Monday and Tuesday? Yes, yes. Three fruits, right? Good job. Let's move to the story. But still the little caterpillar was very hungry. On Thursday, he ate through four strawberries. Do you like strawberries? Yes. But still the little caterpillar was very hungry. On Friday, he ate through five oranges. Children. Still, the little caterpillar was very hungry. On Saturday, he ate lots of food. Let's see what he ate on Saturday. On Saturday, the little caterpillar ate through a piece of cake, a slice of watermelon, a nice corn, a sausage, a lollipop, a piece of cherry pie, and a cupcake. Children, do you know what happened that night? Huh. That night he had a stomach ache because he ate lot, right? But still the little caterpillar was very hungry. And the next day was Sunday again. The little caterpillar ate through one nice green leaf and after that he felt much better. After that he wasn't hungry anymore and he wasn't a little caterpillar anymore. He was a big fat caterpillar. Then the caterpillar went happily and sat on a branch and 
He made a small house called Kukul. After two weeks, the little beautiful butterfly came out from the cocoon. Children, now tell me, the little caterpillar ate four strawberries and five oranges, right? And now tell me, how many fruits are here? Count the fruits. Yes, did you get your answer? Yes, very good. There are nine fruits. Good job. Children, this is the end of the story. Did you like the story? Thank you. Today we are going to learn how to add one digit numbers by counting objects. Your success criteria is you will be successful if you can add three addition numbers correctly from the given one digit numbers by counting. First, let's watch the video. Now we are going to count and add. Children, now we are going to learn count and add. Okay, now look at here. What can you see from here? Yes, there are flowers. Right? Okay. Now tell me how many flowers are there in first set? Count the flowers. How many flowers are there in first set? Very good. There is one flower. Now look at the second one. How many flowers are there in second set? Yes. Good job. Let's check. One. Two. There are two flowers, right? Now tell me how many flowers are there in all together. Count all the flowers. Did you get your answer? Let's take. Count with me. One, two, three. Yes, fantastic. There are three flowers, right? Good job. Now look at here. You can see some sweets. Right? Now count and tell me how many sweets are there in first set. Yes? Very good. Let's check. One, two, three. Good job. Now look at the second one. How many sweets are there in second one? Count the sweets. Yes? Good. Let's check. One, two, three, four, five. Very good. Now let's find out the total number of sweets. Count all together. Yes? What's your answer? Yes. Let's check your answer. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Fantastic. There are eight sweets. Good job. Now look at this. What are these? Apples. Right? Two sets of apples. In first set... There are how many apples? Yes, two apples. Right? And two plus. In second set, how many apples are there? Three. Good. Now let's find out the total number of apples. Count the apples. Did you get your answer? Yes, let's take your answer. One. Two, three, four, five. Yes, there are five vapors. Very good. Now look at here. Oh, butterflies. Right? Some blue butterflies and red butterflies. Now you can see. 
let's find out the total number of blue butterflies count blue, blue butterflies yes there are three blue butterflies now let's count red butterflies how many red butterflies are there very good three red butterflies right now tell me 3 plus 3 is equal how many? To get your answer, you can count all the butterflies. Okay? Count all the butterflies and get your answer. Yes? 3 plus 3 is equal how many? Yes, let's check your answer. 1, 2, 3, Four, five, six. Good job. There are six butterflies. Three plus three is equal six. Children, let's do some activities. Look at this number. Two plus two. What is the answer? We can use some blocks. Count one. 2 and look at the second number 1 2 children now count all together and find the answer of 2 plus 2 let's count 1 2 3 4 what's the answer yes very good the answer is 4 good job Let's find the answer of 4 plus 3. Let's take the bottle caps. 1, 2, 3, 4. And here is 3. 1, 2, 3. So right. Now tell me how many bottle caps are there? 4 plus 3 is equal how many? Yes. Well done. Answer is 7. Great. Let's find the answer of 3 plus 2. This time we will count the fingers. As soon as 3, 3 fingers. 1, 2, 3. And look at this. This time 2 fingers. Let's show 2 fingers. Yeah, it's two fingers. Okay. Now tell me what's the answer of three plus two? Let's count the fingers. Can you count and tell? Yes. Let's check the answer. One, two, three, four, five. Well done. The answer is five. Let's wash our hands. Let's go. Wash your hands, wash your hands, everybody come along and wash your hands, wash your hands, wash your hands, everybody come along and wash your hands. Show me, show me your hands, everybody, show me, show me your hands.
Hello students, it's your quiz time. I'll give you five questions to check how well you have understood today's lesson. Hmm, students, are you ready now? Shall we start? The first question. Here we have two groups of apples. The first group has three apples and the second group has two apples. What you have to do is count the number of apples in both the group and find the total. Now you can start counting to get your answer. Yes, you got the answer. Okay, shall we check it? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So that means 3 plus 2 is 5. Is your answer right? I hope so. Good job. Now the second question. Here you have two groups of oranges. In one group it is 4 and in the other it is 3. Count them and find how many are there all together. Now you can start. Did you get the answer? Okay, now let's see if your answer is correct. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So the correct answer is 7. That means 4 plus 3 is equal to 7. I hope you all have done it correct. Well done students. Now I will move on to the third question. Hmm. Now the third question. This time we have two sets of strawberries. Do you like strawberries? Okay. Now let's find the total number of strawberries here. This time also you have to do the same way as you did before. Count both the groups and find the total. Okay. Start. How much is your answer? Okay, now let me check. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So, how many strawberries are there? 9 strawberries. Did you get 9? Okay, that means 6 plus 3 is equal to 9. Very good. Now the fourth question. This one is a bit different, right? There are no objects to count. Here you have to add the two numbers given and find the sum. Wait, I'll tell you an easy way to get the answer. Use your fingers to count. Okay, start. Got the answer? Okay, let's check. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So the answer is 8. Wow! Brilliant students! Students, here is your last question. It is 5 plus 5. Find the answer by adding the two numbers. It will be easier if you use your fingers to count. Okay, do it now.
Have you got your answer? Now let's check. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So the correct answer is 10. You all got the same answer? Yes, wonderful. Good job. Now I am sure that you can do addition of one digit numbers on your own. And I am very happy that you did the quiz so well today. Children, that's all for today. I hope you all have enjoyed today's lesson. And you all have learned well how to count in it. Okay, now tell me, did you achieve today's success criteria? If you all have achieved today's success criteria, show me happy face. Very good. Children, stay home, stay safe. Bye-bye.